All right, so the first clip I'm going to show you is from Kent Christmas. Here we go. I make a commitment to you, says the Lord, that I will not let the evil steal your midterm elections. Lord says that I'm going to take angels and I'm going to stick them in every precinct and I'm going to stop this subterry that they've been pulling. I'm going to stop this sneakiness and when they think they're headed over there, God said, I will stop them for the Lord says, I make a covenant with you that this is an above election. Now, let's document this. Kent Christmas, an alleged prophet of God, said, God said, your midterm elections will not be stolen. God is committed to this. So much so that I, God, am making a covenant with you. On top of that, and in addition, to further encourage you, I will send angels to all the precincts to protect them as this will be an election from above. Now, for the Kent Christmas followers, do you believe that God said this? Okay. Now, this is Julie Green with Dave Scarlett. You can see the date, November 16th, 2022. Listen to what she says here. About what's going on, and they keep saying, stay focused on me and stay on my word. Yes, there was a red wave last week. There yes. was. They stole it. But, and it was unprecedented, but the thing is, even though if that would have gone that way and they wouldn't have stolen the, the way they stolen it on me and stayed on my word. Yes, there was a red wave last week. There yes. was. They stole it. They stole but, it. And it was unprecedented. But the thing is, even though if that would have gone that way and they wouldn't have stolen the, the way they stolen it, wasn't the... All right, so here, another prophet of God is saying publicly that, in fact, the midterm elections were stolen. In fact, I played this clip twice. She says it three times. We've added the conclusion here. Julie Green unequivocally calls God a liar. For if you believe that God is speaking through Kent Christmas, then those are the words of God. Julie Green came out publicly and said that the midterm elections were stolen, therefore standing in opposition of the very words of God Almighty as spoken through Kent Christmas. One could say, well, she called Kent Christmas a liar. No, 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 you can't say that. If you believe that God is speaking through Kent Christmas, then your conclusion can only be that Julie Green called God a liar. So, Julie, I think it's only fitting that I share this scripture with you. For you are in great danger of coming against Kent Christmas with such veracity. Psalms 105, verse 15, Touch not mine anointed, and do my prophets no harm. How dare you?